We are in Microsoft Access 2013, and I'm going to show you how to import data from a text file. So if we've got a text file that has got all kinds of data in it, we don't want to have to recreate it, so we can just import it as a new table. We'll start out by clicking on the External Data tab, and then we will see a whole bunch of different types of places we can import from, and there's all types of things we can export to. So in this case, we're going to import from a text file. So let's go ahead and choose Browse. This is the source of our file. Scroll down. We see it's Sales. You have a few options here. You can import to create a brand new table. You can append a, an existing table. Or you can link uh, to a ta uh, to, by creating a linked table. So you can choose uh, the equivalent to a pivot table, say, in Excel. Go ahead and click OK. And we're going to go ahead and choose the defaults, so it just imports the data right into this table, but you can make changes if you'd like. So we see our year, we see our sales, we'll go ahead and click Next. And it's going to highlight, do we want to keep that the way it is? Yes, we do. And it's also going to add an ID. Now an ID is handy if you want to make linked tables, so you link this table to something else, other tables in the future, or possibly some other uh, products like Excel. Go ahead and click finish and then click close. Now we have a brand new table that shows up on the left hand side if we double click on it and we can see all the data that came from our text file as well as an ID for each row.